Hello and welcome back to another episode of NASA Space News. The longest ever investigation of Jupiter's upper troposphere temperature has been completed. This is the layer of Jupiter's atmosphere where the big planet's weather happens and where its signature striped clouds form. The research, which took place over the course of four decades and used data from NASA spacecraft and ground-based telescope observations, found surprising data in the rates of temperature change in Jupiter's many belts and zones. This research takes us a big step closer to being able to predict the weather on the biggest planet in our solar system. Similar to our own atmosphere, clouds and storms develop and rage in Jupiter's troposphere. Wind, pressure, humidity, and temperature are just a few of the elements that scientists investigate to make sense of this meteorological activity. In general, lower temperatures are associated with Jupiter's brighter and whiter bands, known as zones, while the darker brown-red bands, known as belts, represent places of higher temperatures. This has been known since NASA's Pioneer 10 and 11 missions in the 1970s. However, there were insufficient data sets to properly investigate seasonal temperature trends. The new study, which came out on December 19th in Nature Astronomy, is a big deal because it directly measures Jupiter's temperatures above the colorful clouds. It does this by looking at images of the bright infrared glow that rises from warmer parts of the atmosphere, which is invisible to the human eye. These images were taken at regular intervals by scientists throughout the course of three of Jupiter's orbits around the Sun, each of which takes 12 Earth years. They found that Jupiter's temperatures go up and down all the time and have nothing to do with the seasons or other cycles that scientists know about. Scientists were surprised to find that Jupiter's temperatures change in such regular cycles. Since the planet has mild seasons, its axis is tilted 3 degrees, while Earth's is tilted 23.5 degrees. The research also found a strange link between temperature changes in places of thousands of miles apart. While temperatures rose at certain latitudes in the Northern Hemisphere, they fell at the same latitudes in the Southern Hemisphere, like a mirror image across the equator. This phenomenon is analogous to the teleconnection of weather patterns over great distances on Earth, when changes in one's region's climate may have a discernible effect on weather in another. The next step is to investigate the root causes of these repeating patterns of activity. With this newfound knowledge, scientists expect to be able to predict Jupiter's weather in the future. This study has the potential to advance climate modeling by simulating Jupiter's and other big planets' temperature cycles and their effects on the planet's weather. That's all for now. Make sure you don't miss any updates by subscribing to the channel. Also, if you enjoyed this video, consider checking out our previous videos. And for up-to-the-minute updates, visit our website at www.nasaspacenews.com. Thanks for watching.